இந்த வீடியோல நாம பார்க்க போறது மேக்னிடியூட் ஆஃப் பயோடைவர்சிட்டி இன் பயோடைவர்சிட்டி இன் பயோடைவர்சிட்டி அண்ட் இட்ஸ் கன்சர்வேஷன் மேக்னிடியூட் ஆஃப் பயோடைவர்சிட்டி பயோடைவர்சிட்டி இஸ் ஆஃபன் quantified as the number of species in a region at a given time so biodiversity vandu evlo number of species quantity level la or kurippitta level la or irukko adha da nama magnitude appdin solrom the current estimate of different species on earth is around 8 to 9 million ipo the current species different species irukliya earth la avanga vandu 8 to 9 million iruka and however we really don't know the exact magnitude of our earth natural wealth so earth oda natural wealth idu variyum namalukku fulla theriyadu this is called the taxonomical impedent so indha mari edha correct ah theriyala illaya so adha nam enna solalam the taxonomic impedent so for about 1.5 million million sorry that 1.5 million species of microorganisms animals and plants have been described so 8 to 9 million species irukku adula 1.5 millions da of plants animals and microorganisms adha vandu describe pannirukanga each year about 10 to 15000 new species are identified and published worldwide of which 75 are invertebrate that is 75 percentage are invertebrates adavudu 10 to 15000 ovvoru varshamo புது புது ஆர்கானிசத்தை கண்டுபிடிச்சி அதை பப்ளிஷும் பண்ணிட்டு இருக்காங்க வேர்ல்டு வைட்ல அதில் செவன்டி ஃபைவ் பர்சன்டேஜ் வந்து இன் இன்வர்டி பிரேட்ஸ் த நம்பர் ஆஃப் அன்டிஸ்கிரைப்டு ஸ்பீஷஸ் இஸ் அன்டவுட்வில் தட் இஸ் அன்டவுட்லி மச் ஹையர் ஸோ டிஸ்கிரைப் பண்ணாத ஸ்பீஷஸ் நிறைய இருக்கு இன்னும் அது இன்னும் அதிகமாக தான் இருக்கும் அப்படின்னு சொல்கிறாங்க இந்தியா இஸ் வெரி ரிச் இன் டேர்ம்ஸ் ஆஃப் பயாலஜிக்கல் டைவர்சிட்டி டியூ டு இட்ஸ் யூனிக் biogeographical location diversified climatic conditions and enormous eco diversity and geo diversity so india var or rich biodiversity irukra nadu ena adoda geographical area ena nama peninsula india illaya peninsula nu solluvom subcontinent nu solala so adanaala adoda biogeographical location and diversified climatic conditions adavadu climatic condition vevvere idhula maarupadudhu illaya and climatic conditions and eco diversity nariya irukku plus geo diversity that is soil geographical idhiliyum diversity irukku according to the world's biogeographic classification india represents the two of the major realms that is paleo arctic and indo malayan and the three biomes tropical humid forest tropical dry or deciduous forest and warm desert or semi deserts so in the world biogeographical classification ah vachi india la or major realms appdi solranga paleo arctic and indo malayan adu onnu and adula three biomes irukam tropical humid forest tropical dry or deciduous forest warm deserts or semi deserts so with only about 2.4 percentage of the world's total land surface india is known to have over 8 percentage of the species of animals that the world holds th- this percentage accounts for about 92000 known species so 2.4 percentage the world or the total land surface so india la vand 8 percentage of species of animals irukku world holds oda world holds and the percentage pathina 92000 vandu therinjirukku so india is the seventh largest country in the world in terms of area so area vachu paathomna india vandu seventh place la irukku the world is that is currently undergoing a very rapid loss of biodiversity comparable with the great mass extinction events that has previously occurred only 5 to 5 or 6 times in the world history by world wild life fund so world vandu or periya threat la poitirukku nariya biodiversity loss aayirukku mass extinction irukku so idu vandu earth oda history la pathina 5 or 6 times indha mari adha occurred only 5 or 6 times nadandirukku so patterns of biodiversity distribution 
the distribution of plants and animals is not uniform around the world so distribution uniform kadaiyadu plants and animals ku illa so organism require different sets of condition for their optimum metabolism and growth so in the organisathukku vandu or particular conditions venum climatic conditions so adu vandu optimum ah irkanum correct ah irundha da and the metabolism and the function plus growth nadakum and the organisathula within this optimal range a large number and type of organisms are likely to occur grow and multiply so in the particular range the, the optimum range na habitat so appa da avangaloda organism vand number vand increase aaga mudiyum so grow nalla valara valara mudiyum and the particular area va kandupidicha anga irupanga so and the particular area na habitat so and the habitat avangaluk ottu pochu na anga avanga irupanga valarchi valarvaanga plus multiply um pannuvaanga reproduce um palluvaanga the heap, the habitat conditions are determined by their latitudes and altitudes so latitudes na equator to the poles equator la or mari irukum vegetation adavad or la or life and the poles and or mari irukum plus altitudes adavad based on the higher elevations so and the condition ke etta mari da the growth nama solrom ya the growth multiplication that is reproduction alla so latitudinal and altitudinal gradients the temperature precipitation distance from the equator altitude from the sea level so in the temperature precipitation adha uh, temperature na heat namba uh, evlo heat irukku adha dhan solrom temperature precipitation plus distance from the equator so idha vandu latitudinal gradient nu solrom altitude na from the sea level adhu vandu altitudinal gradient or some of the factors that determine the biodiversity distribution pattern so latitudinal and altitudinal gradients so latitude na equator la irundhu poles poles variyum illaya appa and the based on the temperature plus and the precipitation and the pani mele vandu pani adhigama irukum poles and and equator anda apdi irukad so appa anga vegetation maarum life adavad organism oda life maarum poles and vera maari irukum adavadhe maari altitudes altitudes na height from the sea level so angiyum changes nadakum so the most important pattern of biodiversity is latitudinal gra- gradient in diversity so latitude latitudinal gradient in diversity da this means that there is an increasing diversity from the poles to the equator so yena poles la irundhu equator vanda and the diversity poles la vanda diversity kammiya irukum biodiversity ana equator region la vanda and equator region kitta poga poga anga vandu vegetation ella organic athoda diversity nariya nama paakalam so this means that there is an increasing diversity from poles to the equator so diversity increases as one moves towards the temperate zone and reaches the maximum at the tropics so the diversity epo increase aagna na temperate region ku pona odane increase aaga aarambikkum and tropics la adu vandu dense aagum nariya irukum and edathula next thus tropic harbor more that is more biodiversity than temperate or polar region especially between the latitudes of 23.5 degree north and 23.5 degree south tropic of cancer to the tropic of capricorn so in the tropic harbor pathina biodiversity anga temperate or polar region so and the edathula vand latitudes vand 23.5 north idu nama globe la kuda paakalam 23.5 north and 23.5 idu vand tropic of cancer and the line ku peru to the tropic of capricorn so and the lines peru nama idu vand geography la padichirpinga neengalo that is next harsh condition exist in temperate areas during the cold season why that is while very harsh condition prevail for most of the year in the polar region so romba harsh ana condition eppo paakala ana temperate region la cold time la cold season la ana polar region la eppome harsh harsh condition da romba okay so idu da the diversity vandu center la adhigamavum center la adhigamavum poles and low diversity a irukra mari kaatirukke inda picture so colombia located near the equator that is 0 degree celsius has nearly 1400 species of birds while new york at 41 degree north has 
105 species and Greenland at 71 degree north has 56 species. So, Columbia is 0 degree kita irk, that is equator kita irk nala, and the Naria species irk, 1400 species of birds irk. And in New York, 41 degree north la irk, that is 105 species irk, Greenland la 71 degrees north irk, and 56 species irk. So, in the basis la, India with much of its land area in the tropical latitudes in is the home for most that that is more than 1200 species of birds so india la 1200 species birds irukku so this is this that's thus thus it is the evident that the latitude increases the species diversity so latitude increase aga aga species diversity nama paakalam decrease in the species diversity occur as one ascends a high mountain due to drop in temperature so due to drop in temperature that is decrease in species diversity na high temperature drop aagum bodu enna nadakkudhu species diversity koreyadhu adhavadhu temperature decreases at 6.5 degree celsius per kilometer ki decrease aachana adhavadhu above mean the sea level la decrease aachana appo and the species diversity koreyum the reason for the richness of biodiversity in tropics are warm tropical region between Tropic of Cancer and Cape Comorin on either side of the equator possesses congenial habitats of the living organisms. So, in the richness of biodiversity, tropics la matto yen patina, warm tropical region under the nala, Tropic of Cancer and Cape 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 Tropic of Cancer and Tropic of Cape 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 uh, congenial, congenial habitats are living organisms are adapting So, the environmental conditions of the uh, tropics are favourable not only for speciation but also for supporting both variety and number of organisms. So, if you the variety is not the environmental conditions this favorable arke. speciation is not favorable arke. That is the variety and number of organisms support panitrik. Temperatures vary between 25 degrees Celsius to 35 degrees Celsius. So temperature varying na, 25 degree to 35 degrees Celsius. So this is range the metabolic activities of the living organisms. That is easy and efficient. Arke. So metabolic activities in the living organisms in the particular range of temperature 25 to 35 degree Celsius. So, average rainfall is often more than 200 mm per year. So, 200 mm rainfall is not all organisms are not good. So, climate, seasons, temperature, humidity, photo periods are more or less stable and encourage both variety and numbers. So, climate is not good. Seasons are all seasons. Temperature is correct, humidity is correct, photo periods are light, that is correct. That is the biodiversity, that is the variety, the number is increased. So, rich sources, that is rich resources and nutrient availability are the So, So, the mean sea level. MSL is an average level of the surface of one or more Earth's ocean from which the height such as elevation may be measured. That is the sea level we measure the height As we travelled by train, we noticed names of the stations on big yellow board, yellow sign board on which it is usually written how much Elevated the place is compared to MSL. MSL means seen level. So, the yellow board is in the yellow and the yellow board is in the yellow board. So, and that is the in the over at the MSL and portrait panga. The note panir kingla panir pinga and a kira in the park lana in the paper paranga. So, yellow sign board on which is usually written how much elevated that place is compared to the MSL. 
For example, E Road Junction is about 171 meters above the mean sea level. So, sea level length E Road, if low, irk junction, E Road Junction, outlaw distance layer like KM 171.91 meters la irk. Okay. So, next species area relationship. Species area relationship or area ko and the species ko ulla. Yes, relationship. So, we are going to be very sophisticated. But we are going to be very sophisticated. So, 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 German naturalist and geographer Alexander von Humboldt explored the wilderness of South African jungles and found that within a region, the species richness increased with increasing the area but up to a certain limit. That is Alexander von Humboldt. He was a naturalist, German, German scientist, naturalist. So, he was in the American jungle school. So, he was in the the species richness increased. He was area which was in the area level increased. And that was a limit. The relation between the species richness and the area for a wide variety of taxa. And the wide variety of taxa patina, angiosperm, plants, birds, bats, freshwater fishes turned out to be the rectangular hyperbola. So the rectangular hyperbola which and the species ko area ko or nalla relationship irukku and the variety of taxonomy yon nama paakkala adha vandhi ebdi solraanga adha ebdi avaru turned out paikkaanga rectangular hyperbola which is solhi irukkaar on a logarithmic scale the relationship is a straight line described by the equation so logarithmic scale la log s is equal to log c plus 2 log a abdi idu mention pani irukkaanga so where s na species richness a and area z and slope of the line that is regression coefficient and c and the y intercept abdin soldranga so regression coefficient z generally has the value 0 0.1 to 0 0.2 regardless of the taxonomic group of the region other the group or a region or a particular uh, taxonomic group or a region illa area illa group abdin vechikitomna and the values on earlier is z z to the value regression coefficient z to the value on the point one and the point two is one mark the cake la. so however in the case of species area relationship in very large areas like entire continents the slope of the line appears to be much steeper so in the species area relationship which larger areas la pathing na the continent at the thing the slope on the fd irukkona much sleep steeper are going so up for the range of the z to the value one the other the regression coefficient of the value one the 0 0.6 to 0 point that is 0 0.6 to 1.2 so in the mari irukko steep we are going the mari irukko steep we are for example in case of the fruit eating that is Frugivorous, that is fruit eating birds and mammals are coming. Fruit eating birds are coming. Fruit eating birds are coming. Fruit eating birds are coming. Fruit tropical birds are coming. Tropical forests are coming. That is tropical forest of different continents. We have a continent like this. Our slope is coming. Steeper line 1 point. Steeper line 1.15 file is coming. So, we will see this. That is the log. And the log of which and the steep is the one that plus in the one then the yes is equal to ca and they do either one the log yes is equal to log c plus 2 uh, that is c plus z log a are the base funny in our graph here okay wow so in the video look pretty good for the video look pretty good like share subscribe to science easy tech channel